Hi guys. So I'm going to show you how to add the meta sci-fi outfits to your meta human characters. So um, first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to open up Quixel Bridge and add a meta human to this project. So I'm just going to go to my meta humans. I have one or two custom meta humans here. Um, I'm gonna choose one. Okay, so uh, I'll go for this one here and I'll add it. And I'm probably going to need to turn on a few plugins for the meta human to work. Uh, this is a new project and it already has the meta sci fi outfits back loaded to it. And I'm going to enable the missing plugins and uh, restart the editor. Okay, so we're back. Our meta humans should be working correctly now. I'm going to close Quixel Bridge and I'm going to go to my meta humans and to my character. I'm going to open up the, the meta human blueprint. I might get a few compiling shaders. I'll So I'm going to go to the viewport and here I've got my meta human character. Okay. So a few textures are still loading up. But uh, basically all you really have to do is um, you just select any mesh or element. If you want you can add one, if you want you can replace it. Uh, but I'm going to select the feet. Okay because I don't need the feet for my outfits. Once I've selected the feet, I'm going to go to uh, any one of my meta sci-fi outfits um, in the skeleton meshes folder. I'm going to choose a female since this is a female. It's the same process for the male as well. So I'm going to choose one of the female outfits from here. I'll go for the, for the, say this one here, the, female heavy armor white and I'm gonna add this mesh uh, I'm gonna replace the, the feet that is the, the slippers here with this mesh and there we go uh, it is added so this will work with all the animations and uh, everything else uh, out of the box So um, the texture is not looking correct. I'm, I'm just going to make a new level so that we can test that out. I'll open a new basic level and drag and drop the character in there. Yeah. Okay, so um, I've added the character to, to the new level and the issue with the texture, or the reason it's different, is because we replaced this feet and it has kept the texture for the mesh that was on the feet. So I'm just going to reset this property to its default value and everything should be fine now. So yeah, like I said, uh, this is just the quickest way to do it. If you want, you can add a new, a new mesh, a new skeleton mesh here but it's fine to even just replace the feet. You can rename them if you want. Um, the reason why I prefer to re replace rather than uh, add a new one is because like LODs are already synced and all the rest of that stuff is already synced. So I prefer to just replace. Okay. And uh, one last thing that you might want to do, it's not absolutely necessary, but one last thing that you might want to do is you might want to um, go to your skeleton mesh um, let's say, actually, probably almost all the females. I want to assign them to the original meta human skeleton. Right now, it's using the female skeleton, which is uh, it's actually the original meta human skeleton, but uh, it's it's separate from what we have in the meta humans uh, folder. So I'm going to select all all of these assets, the female assets, and I'm going to assign 
actually we, we don't need to just do the female assets we can do all the assets and right click on those and assign assign skeleton okay I want all of these to use the meta human base skeleton okay that way our meta human as well as our outfits are all using the exact same skeleton so I'm gonna click on accept and I'll, I'll have to it looks like I have to do it one by one for each one so just click on that accept click on that accept Click on that, accept. Okay, that's a meta human base skeleton. You just do it for all of them. And that way we're sure that everything is using the same skeleton. And it doesn't matter whether it's a female or a male, it will work either way. Okay. Yeah. So I don't have any animations in, in this particular project, but uh, but the animations are going to work straight out of the box. So yeah, this is how you can add the outfits to your MetaHuman characters. Uh, thank you for watching. Uh, have a good day.